So, I looked all around the house for some metal, and turns out uh, pretty much everything I have already has holes in it. Um, I mean, like, perforated holes, intentional holes, not like ones that I've already made. But uh, I did find a chunk. Uh, it's about the thickness of a quarter or so, but I'll give a closer look to it. In the meantime, I'm going to do pretty much the standard. The projectile is looking a little bit worse for wear, like the one that we're using right now anyway. But uh, I don't think that's a big deal. Uh, the machine still, of course, has plenty of power. But that bottom display just isn't going to come on. There we go. It's not like it's going to give an accurate reading anyway. So, throw the projectile in there. Pretty standard setup. And I think I've got it already aimed correctly. I moved the accelerator a little bit closer just to make sure I didn't miss. Um, it's always a possibility. So let's get this thing charging. And I'm actually getting a pretty decent read on the charger right now. So that's actually, if you can see that right, it's uh, 200 volts. And 250 volts. And it's just going to keep climbing until those guys reach like 400 or so. And again, um, hopefully you can hear that. It's just that ever so slight drone of the charger doing its thing. <laughs> You can hear that sound change. So, yeah, it's got some, some power to it. And let's just take a look at the projectile. So we took a big chunk out of that plate. We didn't get all the way through it. But it is a pretty thick plate, so I wouldn't you know, cite us for that, just to give that quarter comparison. 